They estimate that one in four women across the United States experiences domestic abuse each year. One in four. That's mind-boggling for me. And of course, it's not just women. It's men as well. But women are more likely to find themselves in a situation where they lose their source of shelter, where they stay in abusive relationships for fear of not having a roof over their head, not having a shelter for their children. But the good news is the word is getting out. People are seeking the help they need. We do need to grow this facility and we're doing it. And that's where Harbor House and the great work of Carol Wick has come in to be so indispensable. This new facility changes that dynamic and creates an environment that is more than a shelter, that really breeds that optimism and that belief of what they can do and what they can be, that there's a reason to keep going and a reason to move forward. They need to be thinking about tomorrow, not yesterday. Our criteria for giving is usually very simple. It's food, water, clothing, shelter, medical. We believe those five things give people what is their God-given right, and that is to have dignity. And that's what Harbor House does. For us, this house is a road to dignity for a lot of people who have suffered at the hands of bullies. The plaza is filled with people who have given so much and are so committed to this. God bless you. Thank you, each and every one of you. Because of you, we are going to find and provide hope. Thank you.